Welcome back, welcome back, and welcome back. We are going to do a sheet pan roasted chicken and veggies. We've got chicken legs, we've got chicken thighs, we've got potatoes and carrots there, extra virgin olive oil, garlic, steak seasoning, Mrs. Dash, and some Italian seasoning. This is everything we're going to use to make this amazing meal. Let's get cooking. Okay, this is a really simple dish. It doesn't take long to come together. We're going to go in with a couple of tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil. I'm going to put in, and this is two uh, pounds of the baby potatoes and a, um, so I would say two cups of potatoes and a cup of carrots. And we're going to go in with a couple of tablespoons of Mrs. Dash. A couple of tablespoons of the garlic salt. We're going to do it a couple of tablespoons on each one of them. The same with the Italian seasoning. And you can mix these up with any seasonings that you like. There is no wrong way to do it. Whatever makes you and your family happy on the seasoning front, that's what you should do. And then we're just going to give this a nice jush. Easy peasy. The only thing that's going to take a while is this is definitely going to have to cook. We're going to put it in the oven on 350 and we're going to let this cook for a whole hour. It may take about an hour and 15 minutes depending on your oven, but an hour is all I need for mine, okay? I like the way that one looked. Okay. There was another piece. Potato got past me. Didn't look pretty. Okay. So we're going to just give this a nice jush here and then I'm going to put this on a sheet pan. I'm going to divide it up into two because I'm going to cook the size on one and I'm going to cook the, um, if I can get it out, oh it doesn't look pretty. I'm going to put the thighs on one and then the legs on the other one, okay? that down so I can move this one over and then I'm going to divide the chicken up and put the chicken on the of that and I'm going to use the same bowl to season instead of having to change out the bowl okay and there we go and then I'm just going to move that off to the side See a couple of potatoes when they don't look right to me I just don't use them okay and feel free to do the same if you're gonna eat it make sure it looks the way you want it to look you want it to be purdy all right so I'm gonna move this off to the side and we're gonna get that chicken over here all right and we're gonna do the same seasoning again I'm gonna go in with a good tablespoon because I've already got some stuff in there okay and I'm going to go in with a couple of tablespoons of this. And that's the steak seasoning. I'm going to do the same thing with the Italian. A couple of tablespoons of that as well. Garlic salt. A couple of tablespoons. And a couple of tablespoons of Mrs. Dash. And then we're just going to give her a nice little jush. Get all the flavoring all over every single one of those pieces of legs. We want her to be seasoned very well. Okay. And then I'm going to move that sheet pan over here. I'll be right back. All right. And then I'm just going to take those legs and nestle them in between there. You can add onions to this as well if that's what you would like. Just going to put it in there. Nestle them all off in there. And then in the oven she goes for an hour. Okay. And I'm going to do the same process with the other one. I'll be right back. All right. And here we go. We got the thighs on one sheet. If I had a big enough sheet pan and my oven was big enough to handle it, I would be able to get all of those on one. But my mine is not that big, okay? All right, 
So this is what she's looking like. 350 one hour. And there she is, fresh out of the oven. There's the legs, then the thighs. Oh my goodness, things made easy with Gigi. All day, every day. Please like, subscribe, and feel free to share. Everybody be blessed and stay safe. You'll see Gigi next time. Take care, you guys. Are you ready for phase one?